I'm Adila Malik and I go to the University of Texas at San Antonio. My name is Adrian Gonzalez. I'm a uh, physics major here at UTSA. UT San Antonio has been growing for some time and is really uh, finding itself right now. And uh, that growth is really allowing us to do more and more exciting experiments and bring in more and more people. We're, we're young, um, and you get that vibe across campus. So it's young faculty members, uh, it's young administrators, and it is a very fun place to be. I'm doing nuclear uh, fuels research. And the research that happens in this lab allows me to actually fabricate things with my hands. I focus on tri-structure isotropic particles and uh, their failure modes. My research right now is on the spintronics field. It's mostly related with measuring and controlling uh, spin pumping currents. You can do everything from playing with lasers to um, observing stardust to uh, figuring out how nanoparticles help you cure cancer. Our research is kind of at the same time, it covers lots of different areas, but it also has lots of intersections and is kind of a coherent picture. We all help each other. Everyone's looking to be a part of something. And uh, at UTSA, it was pretty easy to, to find a group to be a part of. One of the things that's great about being at UTSA and studying physics is you get a combination of cutting edge research where you really are with some of the world experts where there's new things happening every day. At the same time, um, we um, excel at being inclusive. We, we want to include everybody, regardless of race, gender, disability, gender orientation, any of that. We want to include everybody. And that's the place where UTSA is right now. The environment here at UTSA to me has been very welcoming since the first day. I come from a pretty, I guess, large or extended mixed family, and UTSA has always felt like home. I think one of the best things I've experienced at UTSA is the fact that even though there have a lot of times where I'm often the only female student in the room. I'm only encouraged to keep pursuing what I want to because there's not too many people who look like me in my field. Probably the most impactful moment for me at UTSA was, uh, it was in a course, it was called uh, Advanced Physics uh, Lab. My advisor, he was really into it. He used that data from that in a, in a paper. And so I felt that was my first taste of being like a scientist or a physicist, and I, and I uh, got really addicted to it. I really wanted to do more of it. We have a large population of first-generation students, and the approach that we must have a faculty to the students has to adapt to that and be more understanding of the challenges they, they go through. A lot of the encouragement is to find areas that you're interested in, as well as get experience in areas that you're not interested in. So it's, it's, it's a really good balance of here's what the world's offering, um, do what you want with it. One of the most memorable experience here at UTSA, I think that has been that I have the opportunity to attend to conference, like international conference, and trying to see or to compare my research to with another people around the world. With the collaborations that we have with industry in San Antonio, with places like the Southwest Research Institute, which is based here in San Antonio, uh, we're able to do things that we wouldn't be able to do with just a university. That opens up a lot of possibilities for students to train and be exposed to research even outside of UTSA. I've had the chance to go to Oak Ridge National Lab and work there for a summer, um, adding to my portfolio of skills. And then this last summer I was at Los Alamos National Lab in New Mexico. They get to see a lot of diversity and career options at the National Labs. There's, you know, hundreds of jobs with a physics, bachelor's, master's, or even PhD. After graduation, once I'm done with uh, the PhD, I think I'd like to move on to work at a National Lab. After graduation, I hope I can do, um, mainly focus on research, maybe like at a National Lab. After my undergraduate degree, I plan on, uh, 
earning a PhD in physics. Um, I would like to go into academia, uh, do my own research, and I really look forward to being able to travel around the world for conferences. I want to be able to give back to this department. We're in a position to really uh, even the playing field, to really bring people in that have completely different perspectives. And we know from biology that diversity makes us stronger. And so we can really strengthen science in the US and in the world by bringing together all of those people. And at UTSA, we can really do it.